staying on top of breaking news from overnight. They've got everybody trapped here. This video that alternative Charlotte newspaper Queen City Nerve streamed live on Facebook last night now has lawmakers, city officials and others calling for an investigation. We'll have more on that in just a moment. But first, we want to walk you through yeah. the video. So again, this was a live stream last mm -hmm. night from Queen City Nerve as they reported on the protest. So take a look here. It appears to show a group of protesters. This is along 4th Street last night and CMPD officers are approaching from one end. They're following the marchers. Then there's a group of officers that appears at the other end. That's where those people are headed. So you see they start to move. They start to try to turn around. Then officers begin firing the pepper bullets and tear gas fills the air. And people look to get away, so some even crawled under this uh, parking garage gate to try to get away. Short time later, our reporter Ken Lemon was there at the scene. You could see all the signs left behind, scooters, even uh, shoes that we found, and a whole lot of those pepper balls littering the sidewalks. State lawmaker Chaz Beasley tweeted that he was furious with CMPD and referred to that video saying he refused to stand for his constituents being attacked. City Councilwoman Dimple Ajmira tweeted, just talked to our city manager, Marcus Jones, and he said this will be investigated. And then around 1140, CMPD tweeted this out, saying they are internally reviewing the circumstances that developed this evening on 4th Street to ensure policy and protocol were followed. We know you have a lot of questions about this. We do as well, and it's a story that Channel 9 will be following throughout the day as we speak with those in charge, as well as those who were there last night. Continue to follow it uh, throughout the day with us for those answers as this story develops.